Hey guys, Happy New Year's. It is officially January 2nd as of the filming of this video, and we're officially back on track. And you know who's also back on track? Apple. Apple is back on track with collecting your feedback, fixing issues, and releasing new software updates. According to their previous statement before the winter break, Apple mentioned that they will be back on January 2nd, which is today. And I want to talk about two things. I want to talk about iOS 18.3, the next major update, when we can expect the next beta and some of the features Apple could be working on. But I also want to talk about, which is most anticipated, iOS 18.2.1. And this is a software that Apple has been working on over the past several weeks. But keep in mind, we were on a winter break and hopefully this software will be released soon. We'll talk about some of the things Apple could be addressing with 18.2.1 and when we can expect that software update to roll out to iPhone users. So let's go ahead and dive right into this video. First, let's talk about iOS 18.3 developer beta 2, when we can expect the next beta. Now, keep in mind that last year, iOS 17.3 Beta 2 was released on January 3rd. Today is January 2nd. Now, I don't believe Apple will release any betas this week. It is January 2nd, as I mentioned, a Thursday. Tomorrow is the 3rd on a Friday. I don't believe we'll see any betas. I could be wrong, but if Apple does release iOS 18.3 Beta 2, obviously, I will be covering that for you guys. But my best guess is that the next beta for iOS 18.3 should be available on Monday or Tuesday next week on the 6th or the 7th or sometime during next week. So just keep in mind that Apple could release at any moment, but my best guess is starting next week since it is a Thursday and a Friday here at the beginning of the year. And I don't think Apple will release any betas then. We'll have to wait and see, but obviously I'll keep you guys posted. Now, iOS 18.3, the next beta, there's a few things we're looking forward to. Number one, Apple is rumored to be bringing finally the sketch option for Image Playground. Keep in mind that when they announced the Image Playground app, there was three options, the animation, illustration, and obviously the sketch option. Sketch is not here just yet, but hopefully with iOS 18.3, 18.3 beta 2 or perhaps sometime even later we could see that new option populate here on the image playground application now apple is also working on a new apple intelligent feature called battery intelligence now this was found within frameworks of ios 18.2 by 9 to 5 mac we haven't seen this feature just yet but perhaps we'll see this with future betas for ios 18.3 now you see right there this feature would allow you to see how long it will take for your iphone to fully charge once you plug it in again we don't have any evidence that this will happen within the next beta but hey who knows apple could release this feature at any moment for Apple Intelligent Devices. Now there's other updates happening in the background here for Apple Intelligent Devices. For example, Genmoji skin tones have been updated for Apple Intelligence. There's also a minor update to how notification summaries are being delivered within Apple Intelligence, moving forward with 18.3. So iOS 18.3 is shaping up to be a pretty nice solid stability and polished update for iPhone users. We'll have to wait and see, but keep in mind that this official software, iOS 18.3, should be available the official final version sometime towards the end of January. So I'll keep you guys posted as more betas become available. We get a better idea as into when we can expect iOS 18.3 to be released to the general public. Now, next, I want to shift my focus over to iOS 18.2.1, which is the next official software to be released to iPhone users. Now, Mac Rumor has found evidence of iOS 18.2.1 on their website analytics logs, which means that Apple devices running the software has been visiting their website. Now, when this starts happening, we typically see the software release within a couple of days, but we were on a winter break. Keep in mind that Apple was on a winter break until today. So iOS 18.2.1 will be released here soon. I'll talk about the release date here in just a couple of seconds, but I do wanna talk about a few issues with iOS 18.2, which I'm hoping Apple will address with iOS 18.2.1. So for starters, I want to talk about screen unresponsiveness. This is an issue that continues to be reported. I've had this issue several times where you tap around the display of your iPhone and it does not respond to touches. This is something that continues to happen sporadic, but it happens often now more than it did before. So iOS 18.2.1, hopefully, should address and will address some of those unresponsiveness on iPhone's display. Number two, I know a lot of you guys are having battery issues. I haven't had battery issues, but I see more reports of poor battery and battery drain on iPhone with 18.2. So hopefully 18.2.1 will address any battery concern for iPhone users. And number three, and these are issues that I've had myself, and that is camera issues on iPhone 16 and even iPhone 15. Some iPhone users experiencing freezing on the application with switching between lenses in the front and rear camera. I've experienced this several times times 
on my iPhone 16 Pro Max. But nonetheless, Apple could be addressing also some security vulnerabilities and issues with the next update 18.2.1. Now, with all that being said, when we can expect this software to be released to the general public. Now, my best guess is that Apple will also release iOS 18.2.1 sometime next week on the week of the 6th of January, the first full week of the year. So Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday, no one really knows exactly when iOS 18.2.1 will be released, but we know that Apple is definitely working on this software, and there's many issues and bugs that Apple could be addressing with this next one, and I'll keep you guys posted as soon as that become available. So make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for more updates. Thank you for watching. Again, Happy New Year's, everyone. Thank you for staying tuned here to the channel. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.